Welcome to the Science Whisperer channel. Have you ever wondered how technology could directly interface with the human brain? Neurotechnology aims to do just that, by using advanced tools to study and manipulate the brain. One example of neurotechnology is deep brain stimulation, which uses electrical impulses to treat Parkinson's disease. Another example is brain computer interfaces, which allow people with disabilities to control devices using their thoughts. Neurofeedback is a technique in neurotechnology that uses real time brain activity data to train the brain. Neuroimaging techniques like fMRI and EEG allow scientists to visualize brain activity and study cognitive processes. Neurotechnology has also been used in the field of virtual reality to enhance immersive experiences. Researchers are studying neurofeedback and virtual reality as potential treatments for mental health disorders. Neural implants are devices that can be placed in the brain to restore or enhance brain function. Some neurotechnologies are being developed to improve memory and learning capabilities in humans. By understanding the brain at a deeper level, neurotechnology has the potential to revolutionize medicine and enhance human capabilities. Thanks for viewing this microlearning video and don't forget to subscribe for further updates.